Hyundai Motor Philippines has invited us to join them in an exciting journey to put the Stargazer X through its paces. Now, this is the perfect time to check out kung ano nga ba ang pinakaiba ng range-topping Stargazer X versus the standard base models. This is Paolo, and welcome to Zig Wheels. Alright, so right behind me is the Hyundai Stargazer X. And as we've mentioned earlier in this video, we're going to point out some of the subtle differences between the Stargazer X model and their regular Stargazer. So since I'm already standing right here at the front, let's start with the front end of this vehicle. Okay, so its hood now has a more sculptured look. So it has uh, indentations or contours on each side which as a result gives the middle portion of the bonnet a more elevated look. And below it is a more detailed front grille with some of its bits, you know, slightly protruding. One would also find that its lower front lip or its chin is now finished in a matte material, right? Uh, now let's go ahead and see what's on the side. Right, so right here, the Hyundai Stargazer X come with unique appointments, which are its black roof and its pair of roof rails. However, Hyundai wrote right here that one should not apply load, which is why I think it's more of a cosmetic feature rather than a functional one. Right below, uh, the Hyundai Stargazer X gets SUV-like appointments uh, in the form of these black wheel arches and these claddings on the bottom of each door. Now, they serve, unlike the roof rail, uh, more of a functional matter so they kind of protect the car from stones. I would also like to point out that the flax of the Hyundai Stargazer X is more chiseled and it looks more athletic. Also, it wears a two-toned wheel that you know adds a certain level of sportiness to this multi-purpose vehicle. Now let's go ahead and see what's at the back. The Hyundai Stargazer X wears a sporty roof-mounted spoiler under which you will find its third brake lamp. Okay, so more unique appointments. Uh, the Stargazer X logo and the rear bumper which sort of mimics, you know, the three-dimensional grille uh, elements at the front. So you get design continuity uh, from the front up to the rear end. Also, it has, you know, very sporty angles and lines which overall i think you know uh, makes it a suitable ride for filipino car owners looking for uh, a more adventurous type of vehicle right so inside the hyundai stargazer x we see some subtle changes and one of the most noticeable is its redesigned and rather more seamless housing for the instrument cluster and the infotainment system now, replacing the gray and rather uh, ginormous and clunky housing for the two screens is now a sleek and uh, sexy housing that's finished in piano black. Now, for me, it's okay to put uh, piano black material on these uh, surfaces because you don't usually touch them. And that, for me, is good. It adds a certain level of uh, premiumness to the interior of the Hyundai Stargazer X. Now, complementing the elegant-looking shift knob is a brushed aluminum housing, which, again, adds uh, a premium feel to the interior of the Stargazer X. Also, I would like to point out that the seats of this vehicle now has red stitching. Um, that gives it a more sporty look. The Hyundai Stargazer X also comes with the features, or rather interior features, of the regular Stargazer model. If you want to watch or see a more detailed review of this vehicle, we have a review in our channel done by Roy Robles. It's also worth mentioning that the Hyundai Stargazer X has three row seats. So right now we're driving the Hyundai Stargazer X and currently we're somewhere in the Bulacan area along North Luzon Expressway. That said, we were able to test out two of the most important ADAS features of this MPV, and that is the Lane Keeping Assist and the Adaptive Cruise Control. The former, Lane Keeping Assist, is very useful in making sure that you stay, of course, I mean, it's granted, they just stay within your lane. Uh, and then the latter, the Adaptive Cruise Control, can help lessen your fatigue when you're driving 
like right now in the highway or in the expressway. At the moment, we're en route to Pampanga Pottery Agritourism Park. By the way, we have been told that the roads leading to the pottery are, you know, pretty narrow, which is perfect for testing out the nimbleness, you know, and the capabilities of the Stargazer or the Hyundai Stargazer X. As we've been told, it's, you know, it looks big on the outside, but it's really uh, able to squeeze in through those narrow, you know, narrow streets. All right, so basically, ito na ngayon, yung narrow roads uh, na papunta dun sa destination natin. So just like what I've said earlier, ito yung mga typical roads sa uh, Metro Manila. So medyo, uh, medyo makipot and at the same time yan, you have road bumps or potholes in the case of those in the Metro. So now we are here at the mansion in Pampanga which will serve as our abode for the night. And as you can see, uh, it's already late. We did arrive here at 5 o'clock but we had to freshen up. So there you go. Hyundai Motor Philippines has set up as you can see here, a fireplace, an outdoor movie theater, and Korean barbecue. This also serves as a perfect avenue to showcase or to highlight some of the features of the Hyundai Stargazer X, which in this case happens to be its all LED lighting setup. So here at the front, uh, the Hyundai Stargazer X has an all LED light bar, which also serves as its daytime running lights. And below that, on each side flanking the grill, which we've mentioned earlier, are LED headlamps and its spark lamp, which you can see here. Overall, uh, the lights on the front fascia of the Hyundai Stargazer X contributes to its uh, futuristic look, which is something that uh, most car buyers are going for. Now let's see what it has to offer at the back. Here at the back, although you might not see it right now because it's already set up for, you know, picnic, uh, are H-shaped LED tail lamps, which gives the Hyundai Stargazer X a very distinct look. Now, even uh, without looking at the nameplate, the people driving behind you would know that you're driving a Hyundai Stargazer X. So Hyundai Motor Philippines has been kind enough to treat us to the kind restaurant. And speaking of which, if you feel like being kind to your kids or your other family members, do consider checking out the Hyundai Stargazer X. Overall, our experience with this multi-purpose vehicle slash crossover has been good. Um, it is spacious enough to seat seven occupants while still being small enough to go through the tight and narrow roads here in Pampanga. Also, thanks to its higher ground clearance and its 17-inch wheels, our ride has been Comfortable. It also has disc brakes at the front and at the back, which will give you more peace of mind while you're on the road. So again, this is Paolo from Zig Wheels.